is this what streetcar service will look like in Milwaukee? Yeah, it'll be very similar. So the uh, Kansas City streetcar is 2.2 miles. Our system's are about 2.1 mile route. Modern vehicles. Uh, actually, we're using the same rail type that they're using here. Yeah, it's a similar style to what they use in, in Europe, and it's, it's an age-old use, and, and you actually have the steel rail uh, it's for the, the rubber tire to, to roll through, so it's much quieter, smoother. They don't have standing bike racks um, on their, their car. For whatever reason, they chose not to have that, but you're allowed to wheel your bike right onto the car. We'll actually have little racks where you can lift your bike up and put it up and, and hang it there to save some space for passengers. But the doors, as you see here, automatically open when the car comes to a stop. And ours will do the same thing. But if it doesn't open for whatever reason, you just do the touch and it, and it opens right up. So we have a very similar design to the overhead cables as they have. A single, a single wire, a smaller single wire um, to try to keep that aesthetic um, a very soft. You can actually... They don't have very many street trees in Kansas City, but you can barely notice the wires. Uh, going back to the track for a moment, it's made in Pennsylvania. We're told that Kansas City is the second city in the U.S. to use it. Milwaukee will be the third. Live in Kansas City, Patrick Palantonio, WISN 12 News. feel like I was taking a ride. Thanks, Patrick. And as for Milwaukee streetcar, the project's already headed down the tracks. The city has hired a company to build five of the cars. Bids to build the actual rail system are due June 1st. The first route is expected to be up and running by 2018 with a second lakefront loop completed the following year.